There is an island on this map that doesn't actually exist, but it showed up on this map from 1908 that claims that some whaling ship discovered it. It would be one thing if this just appeared on some old map as a mistake, but it started to appear on a bunch of other maps, including Google Maps, which showed Sandy Island up until 2012, when scientists aboard a ship crossed this area and found nothing. So how did this fake island survive on maps for like a hundred years? Scientists think that maybe the whaling ship that discovered the island actually saw a bunch of rocks that had been ejected from an underwater volcano and they were like, hey, look, there's an island. But why did this error remain for so long? Basically, it was a long game of telephone. Since people rarely travel through this area, this non-island was transferred from one map to another until it made its way into this database, which took physical nautical maps and made them digital. This database happened to be one of the most widely used sources of modern map data, including by, wait for it, Google Maps. And they swiftly removed it once they realized that 